Okay, right. It's the following morning at <laughs> Malt Kiln Farm Shop. I had to think then what the name was again. I forget everything. <laughs> so, uh, what, do you think, what do you think for the night? Oh, was it a decent was, night? Oh, it was great. We had a lovely, peaceful night, didn't we're we? There, look, we're there. <laughs> I'm going to poke you in the eye in a minute. She don't look at the camera. <laughs> look, there it is. Look, there they are. They're looking at you, look. <laughs> yeah, it was lovely. We had a lovely, peaceful night, didn't we? Yes, we did, yeah. Yeah. And it was nice and cool as well. All oh, that, yeah. After all the heat we had. Charlie had a nice walk, didn't week. we? And... Yes, we had a nice, just, well, it's, it, you know, it is what it is. It's a car yeah. park, but there is some grass uh, bits, and behind us especially. Yeah, and with uh, some benches. It was nice. Yeah, it's been a, it's been a nice experience. Uh, I wouldn't stay here day after day no because it's, it's too busy you get a lot of cars coming in i mean what time is it now it's just gone nine o'clock in the morning and uh we've already getting uh, a few cars coming in so we're going to leave now on to our next uh destination which is uh, rugby club. <laughs> <laughs> we're just going to go and have a look haven't kenilworth we? rugby club um apparently it's five pounds to stay a night and they've got a separate section for us to park in. It ain't like a a proper site, I don't think. It's we don't know yet for sure. But the only thing is, there's apparently I think there's a barrier, a height barrier. I think it might be two meters, but you can open it. Apparently, you can open it and shut it. But I don't know where to reach it. <laughs> I'm just saying. Um, so we'll see when we get there. It'll be interesting, we'll just, won't it? Yeah, so, we just wanted to check it out, see what it was like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna, yeah. I'm not sure how long I'm going to stay there for. If it's decent to me, the boy might be a couple of days. Yeah. And there's a. Oh, I've got an email on there my phone. There might be lots of nice rugby players. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, probably under 15 rugby yeah. club. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, let's get this started. There we go. Wind is going up. <laughs> down, down. Down, sorry. Down. It's not boiling hot, so we're not going to have the aircon cool. on. We've had the air conditioning on quite a lot lately. Yeah, we? but I would definitely recommend this place. It's been really nice. Yeah, it's been bang on. Really quiet at night time. There's loads of people coming in already. There's a side bit by <laughs> that green building for to pick your own, isn't there? Yeah, you know, pick your own people. <laughs> Shut up. Get yeah. going. Yeah, so, uh, right, so. But don't forget, we've got to pick a couple of parcels up from um, the locker. Oh yes, yes, we've got to pick a couple of parcels from the locker, she just said. <laughs> Amazon locker. So I uh, ordered a couple of things, haven't I? Yeah. Uh, which I think I've already mentioned on a previous video, actually. So, right, yeah, so I'm not sure if we're going to be able to go into that garage now, because I'm not sure of the route. Yeah. In fact, I better put that into the sat-nav. Would help, wouldn't it? Yeah. Because I haven't got a clue where we're going. There you go, so that's it. So... Charlie's all insecure. Charlie's secure. Ready Let's get going. Ride. <laughs> and off we go. Quarter, she's munching on them things again. Look what you got. Very about half a one. <laughs> oh, and there's poor Charlie. <laughs> he ain't got nothing. Yeah, he's just had some sausages. He's just had sausages. Yeah, we had a little bit of a fry up, and in fact, this is his leftover for later. Look for Charles. This is how spoiled he is. Look at this. They're good sausages as well. Yeah, I get dead jealous, you know. <laughs> Although I have you had some. I know, I just said I've had some as well, but mm, I, I could have them I later. Call in the gammon, oh, oh, yeah, hold on. Shall I show him the gammon? Yeah. All right, then, this is the gammon. 
Remember the gammon we showed you? She's cooked it. Well, we've got to get rid of the horrible fat stuff off it, but she's done that. So uh, that'll be uh, for our tea, won't it? With uh, you've done some coleslaw, haven't you? Yeah, she's done some coleslaw. Hold on, let's get this camera turned around. That's better. Sorry. This messes up. I press the side button on this uh, action camera. It's supposed to switch the screen, the view, and uh, it gives me some jip now and again. So, right, okay. So, what I'm gonna show, oh, first of all, show you where we are. Yeah, now we haven't we haven't actually paid yet. I've been over, but the bloke ain't there till three o'clock. So, I've got to go and pay him. Hey, go away. There's a wasp out here trying to get to our bacon. Okay, so this is it. This is uh, Kenilworth Rugby Football Club ground and uh, I'm gonna again switch the view so I can see what I'm filming so uh, there you go look this is where we are so uh, beyond past us over there I'll show you in just a second is the actual main building and that's the actual uh, rugby ground and we've got this spot here it looks like you just basically part where you want to park I mean, this bit over here is a bit rough and ready, but so what? It's a bit of rough ground on the corner, you know. But, uh, but yeah, it's bang on. And uh, five pound a night, five pound a night. Um, I think they've got, if you want some water and things, I think they've got water for you and stuff like that. And when it's open, you can use the toilets and what have you. Um, but I mean, we've got, we're all self-contained, don't we? So we're, we're all right with that, but, but so what? Five pound. So stop over. So there you go. So brilliant. Uh, just quickly show you what's behind. You can just about see it. it's a bit dipped down, but that's the actual clubhouse over there. And apparently, apparently the owner lives over there as well. There's like a flat part of it or something uh, in the flat. Uh, so uh, I haven't seen him yet. But like I said, I'll go over in a bit and uh, pay him. I, I think Jan's on about possibly staying here for two nights. So if she if, if we do that means we knock on the head one of the other places we're on about staying. But to be honest, one of them was a car park which I wasn't that keen on anyway, so we'd probably knock that one on the head, uh, which is not nothing special anyway. It was just on the route. So uh so as you've probably seen already, I had to go out and undo the barrier. <laughs> that was a pure guess by the way, that you can lift the top off and you know. But I ain't saying it's always open so don't uh, assume that i'm just maybe lucky that time so uh but yeah so i'm not sure what the owner will say to that he'll probably tell me off <laughs> probably say get out of here so anyway uh another thing since we've been here uh it's still not quite noon yet um i've already had a walk down to a garage we went past on the way in uh, which is about nearly a mile down the road I left Jan here with the dog and I walked out the exit up there and I walked down there uh, to the Amazon lockers the Amazon lockers and I already knew that was there because I already pre-planned it and ordered a couple of items for Amazon and I'm going to show you them now uh, before I do wing mirror protectors is one of them and that's the one uh, I'll show you the other side is where we got hit in the past uh, do you remember when we got hit? And you can still see there's some scuff marks there. It's not too bad actually, but there's scuff marks there. And we had to replace that bit, do you remember that? So now I've bought some protectors at long last and they're white ones. So uh, if people can't see them as they're driving towards us, they shouldn't be on the road, yeah? So I've got them, I'll, sh I'll show you, I'll show you. Let's, let's go in and show you. Shouldn't let any wasps in. <laughs> Okay, so this is what it came in, obviously inside a big box, and it was actually delivered to the Amazon locker, even though it's a big box, because uh, the Amazon lockers do have the big bits at the bottom of the lockers uh, to use. So, but yeah, this is a Milenko, so it's, uh, apparently it's a pretty good make. So, uh, and that's it there, and I took them out here, and I've also got this as well. This is not to do with them. This was a separate item which we should have bought some time ago, shouldn't we? <laughs> this funnel. Now, this is Andy. Uh, we haven't, I can't see us using it yet, but one day we might end yeah. up using it. It could be a bit of a lifesaver if you want to put water into the water tank and you're wild camping. 
because you might be like no way of getting from the tap directly into your tank so you can use the tap fill up the water bottles bring it over and put that into the hole in the side of the van and fill up and see so you've got a little filter in there and you can see that or not a little filter in there and all it didn't cost much how much was it about 12 quid from amazon is it something like that something like 12 quid i think so. one, though, you know. yeah yeah i wanted one that you've got there's a lot of them the bottom parts they are stiff they're not bendy with this one you can bend it you see and point it inwards at the side at that angle so yeah it's a lot better okay then these are the chunky protectors look so uh i'm gonna go and put them on and then uh yeah we'll see what it's like afterwards so back in a mo i would show you but it's boring putting them on <laughs> and the battery's going <laughs> so back in a mo okay i'm done got my screwdriver that's all i needed screwdriver and see what you think to this then dun, dun, dun. how about that then and if you're a driver coming down the road towards us you can't tell me you can't see them yeah you can't see them <laughs> but you can see them but you can't tell me you can't see them because they stand out a mile so that is much better i've been wanting to do this for a while but i say 60 odd quid but i tell you what i think that's well worth it yeah really good so to put them on it's just simple this is why i didn't film myself because it's so easy to put on you just you basically just obviously you got it cut out there for your indicator so you just push it on from behind yeah, i start with this side first because they overhang here at the sides you can see so put them in first that way at that angle and then put your arm around there and push it around the back here uh, this side comes round here and then this bit is the bit you attach it's just two screws holding on this sort of like a clamping effect it's a very simple piece of plastic really uh, put the two screws in and you're done there you go so now hopefully that'll stop idiots from hitting our wing mirrors but we probably won't you know what the drivers are like in england <laughs> and well probably everywhere actually so well i'm going to put my screwdriver back and then i'm going to go and sit down for a bit and chill out and uh there's a march going on in london big one and uh we're watching that live on uh youtube which will be finished with by the time you see this of course but uh, a real big one so uh, we would be there actually if we could join in i won't tell you what it's about you should all know by now but you might not because it's not on the normal media but we won't talk about that on this channel <laughs> are you watching it now <laughs> right okay see you later <laughs> i'm gonna <laughs> kick you you nuts <laughs> <laughs> language oh, this is a family channel i didn't know you was filming <laughs> <laughs> right so <laughs> i'll come this side if you can see both of us well you can't miss us can you? <clears throat> well i'm not saying nothing i'll get shot so what have you been doing this afternoon by the way um, not a lot really yeah. what have you been watching on the telly <laughs> rugby rugby rubbish <laughs> i can't really show you oh. <laughs> copyright issues but it's something live on youtube can't really go into it can we because it's the c word anyway um but yeah so i thought uh we'd uh come on just for a moment uh i I'll thought put you the... finished you see, look at that, hey, look, she pulls out again. What are you playing? A little bit. Wait, is it something rude? Yeah. <laughs> no, really, you're playing cards again, aren't you? <laughs> right, so of course, uh, since uh, we've been here, this, I think they're watching rugby down at the rugby club. I don't mean live rugby. It uh, must be something on the telly. It must be some rugby match. I don't know. I don't, I don't follow rugby. No. It's probably England or something. I ain't got a clue. So we'll keep hearing cheering now and again. <laughs> but anyway, since we've been here uh, this afternoon, we have got some extra people here. So you can see there's two vans here. Look, they come up uh, just a bit ago, weren't it? Yeah, from Whitby. Apparently come down from Whitby. I don't know where. They're from that above. Just when I spoke to them a bit ago, a nice couple with a couple of kids, um, Julie and Phil. Very nice. I don't think any of these are full-timers, but 
Julie and Phil told me they want to be, but they ain't retired yet. So when they're waiting to get retirement age, and then they'll consider it. Yeah, so that's that's that. a good thing. But yeah, I'm just gonna have a, a quick pee. Do you, a bit do you want me to lift the flies? No, no, because I can see. <laughs> <laughs> it's, you know, it's a bit rude, really, isn't it? Me doing that, but uh, but yeah, it's lovely, isn't it? That's uh, that's a Hymer. It's got a dual axle and what have you. I'm not really into vehicles normally, but I do like them Hymers. But it is a, it's a bit big for us, isn't it? We don't want anything that big. Oh no! But no. it's nice, but it's though, nice, isn't it? It's nice, yeah. It's a nice yeah. vehicle, yeah. and uh, these ones here look. And I do like these now, you know, the camper vans. Uh, they're both nice. I like both of them. I think if we had one of them, which one would you go for? I don't know. What do you think? A quick gander. She's not had a proper look yet. I don't know because I can only see the back of this one. Yeah. Both nice. Both nice. You know what? I reckon I'll go for the white one because it looks stealthy. <laughs> <laughs> stealthy. Although, having said that, I suppose you could see the awning on it and the long black windows down the sides. But oh, I still like it. I like both though. Anyway, yes. So, what have you been doing? Apart from eating, <laughs> you had a big walk is earlier, didn't you? Yeah, we went for a big walk. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yes, so I've been and paid uh, to, for two nights, haven't we? Yeah. Two nights. Um, and then we're off to somewhere else, which I forgot where we're going next, actually. It might be, actually, that campsite. But I'm not sure if we're going to get on it or not. You're gonna have to ring I'll up. Have to I think. Find, yeah. Ring yeah. them up tomorrow and see if you can get in. Because <laughs> I think it's only five spaces. I doubt if we will. That's well. why we've been doing this and stopping round here because the seafront and the beaches are absolutely packed, oh, aren't yeah. they? Well, we can't really. Well, we could have gone to the seaside, but the thing is, it's, it's miles and miles for us. And we, oh, there's a cheering again. And also, we're only on a week touring haven't we yeah yeah so I thought yeah because we're keep... picking melody up aren't we yeah so, so keeping to the west midlands find the somewhere nice to take melody yeah so glad of that but uh but yeah so that's really not quiet well, but, it, was well it was quiet it was yeah quiet. it was quiet until the rugby came on or whatever but uh i say there's no live rugby game here but the at the rugby it's club nice down there just to chill out for a bit hasn't it yeah <laughs> <laughs> She <laughs> don't like the camera. <laughs> you still can't get used to it, can you? But yeah, it's nice chilling out. Yeah, chilling out. Yeah, and chilling out. well, I have. Well, I've cooked. You know, I've cooked the dinner. I've cooked that ham up. Made some coleslaw. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> yeah, she's been cooking away again. And uh, yeah, so yeah, that's it. Anyway, we're gonna nice sign off. To chill, cause it's cooler as well, isn't it? <laughs> she always puts in. <laughs> 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 so anyway yes uh i think yeah oh well, i might have a little walk tomorrow up the road here and show you a little bit more of this bit but there's not a lot to see really is there it's, it's not around here there's not it's, it's you can hear the road a little bit but it's it's pretty quiet isn't it yeah. chat's nice down the rugby club isn't yeah. it yeah oh outside outside there where we actually came down the road <laughs> <laughs> past, over janice's big head <laughs> Uh, <laughs> You're definitely going to get a sock in it. Socking it. Yeah, the road outside. Because when we was looking at this, we were planning it out. You know, we always we always wonder what the area is like. You know, don't we? Because oh, you never yeah. know. I mean, you could be on a rough housing estate. You don't know. <laughs> you do get them, and we don't want to park near them, do we? Obviously. So of course, uh, when we was coming up the road, because I had a feeling it weren't that anyway. I was coming up the road here. Oh, blimey, the houses. All, all big giant houses. You need to have a bit of money if you're going to move into one of these houses around here. So, yeah, yeah. And it's, uh, like I say, there is uh, the barrier. But, um, but yeah, yeah, it's all right, isn't it? Yeah, so, sure. yeah, I think we can pretty much recommend this even before our first night here. I think it seems Don't like say it's. That. Yeah, it's now going to all go <laughs> Tempting fate. fate now. <laughs> But yeah, uh, so I'll pop back on in a second for you, but it'll be tomorrow for us, and I'll show you the last bit I want to show you before we move on to the next location. Yeah, so, but for five pound a night, I mean, it's yeah, brilliant. And five pound a night. Water, can't you? Yeah, apparently you can go and get some water from down there if you want. So and you, we've, but, uh, we've got loads of water. Yeah, I think they've got a private function on tonight, haven't they? They've got a barbecue in there. The, well, that was earlier on. Yeah, but you can go, go down um, and have a drink. You can go and have a pint if you want yeah. down the club. Yeah. Um, tempted. 
Because <laughs> Jan never bought me any beers. Because you're driving. Oh, yeah, well. Ah, I never drink and drive. No, don't. that's why you didn't have any. Yeah, don't think from that I drink and drive. I never do, do I? No. Anytime I have a little bowl, you see me drink little bowls is when I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> yeah, not by driving. No, I don't. Right, okay. Sign off now. Bye. Back in the morning. <laughs> Back in the morning. <laughs> Bye. Good morning. It's the following morning. Uh, oh, come here, you. So I'm with a dog, as you can tell, he's yanking me along. Time for his morning walks, isn't it, mate? <laughs> oh, nice night last night. All nice and peaceful. Uh, well, there was a bit of music playing from somewhere. It could have been from the clubhouse, but that's fair enough, isn't it? <laughs> it's a clubhouse. But it didn't go on that long, really. And uh, yeah, it was really nice. Good night. Uh, we're here for tonight as well. And then we're moving on. So, uh, but yeah, following day, yeah, good night. And uh, all the vans, look, have vanished. <laughs> it's just us again now. Uh, so obviously all the others, just for one night. Um, met a few people, uh, chatted to some of them. Uh, really nice people. So, uh, but yeah, smashing. So let's go a walk with his lordship. There is actually a bit of a, it looks like a country park, not too far from here. We did actually get to the entrance yesterday. But um, by the time we got there, he's already panting and he's knocking on. I've got to watch, you know, and he's got a dodgy leg. Um, so I have to watch that. So uh, I'm not going to kill him off. <laughs> but I could walk for miles. Uh, looked on the maps, Google Maps this morning, and two miles away is Kenilworth Castle. I can actually see it from here in the distance. I don't know. I don't think I can. But, um, but yeah, I've been there before, so if you uh, want to know what Kenilworth Castle is like, uh, check um, up here. I'll put the link up here somewhere. And uh, that's my exploration of Kenilworth Castle. <sighs> you stop pulling me, you devil. That's a true blessing. So, uh, yeah, here's the, uh, here's the pitch. There's the clubhouse in the distance there. There's a little stand for someone to watch or maybe video or something the games i say it's a, i think it's a i assume it's like an amateur club it ain't like a proper full big club is it ain't no stands here but uh but yeah i was gonna have a beer last night but i was i was knackered i just it couldn't even be bothered to go and have a beer um but uh, you can do if you ever come here you can uh, go down to the clubhouse and have a drink I'll show you some of the houses that's on here. <laughs> oh dear. I'm in that situation again, and I look at the houses thinking, why? <laughs> why? Why do you want to live in such a big house? I've no idea. Uh, some people do. <laughs> nice houses, though. Give them that. Bit of a mishmash. Bit, uh, you know, some different to others. And... So, uh, yeah, have a gander. No dogs allowed, Charles. <laughs> no dogs allowed. It. <laughs> so as you can see, we're quite nice along here. Yeah. So when you go to a new place and you see that the place is right next to a load of houses, you always look and you think, I just hope it ain't in a roof area. <laughs> we did go to one place like that in uh, in Rugby actually. And it was uh, next to a housing estate, which was really rough. And I thought, yeah, I don't think we're staying there for the night. But uh, if you're that fit, mate, I might take you down that country park thing. We'll have to see. But uh, yeah, it's a very nice area, isn't it? So there, we've uh, made it. There's the entrance just behind me. We've just, uh, well, I've been pulled in. By his lordship and uh yeah look at this it's a nice uh, some sort of country walk anyway there was another bit to the side back there but it was a bit uh i couldn't see what was coming but yeah, so you could suddenly have a dog coming around the corner so because of him i have to uh be aware of that you know it might not be any park it might be just uh, a walk through to another estate i don't i've, I've no idea it's a nice little bit anyway. It's, I thought it would be too far to 
you know come here and walk around here and i thought well he's that energetic this morning i'm gonna i'm gonna let him do it be knackered when we get back so yeah yeah what do you think to them houses uh, <laughs> nice boxes isn't they oh you know um, houses yeah not for me not interested at all it's uh, it's really funny you know i still say the same i tell everybody the same and i mean what i say is the feeling of being in a house now oh my god it's it's like a a feeling of dread isn't that weird I never thought I'd ever feel like that about being in a house. What to do? The thought of it. It's a feeling of dread like being trapped. Trapped in one box. No way. No way. Although we still have our own plans for the future, like for off-grid homestead. That's a different thing though. That's a different thing. I'm going to sign off right here and uh, it's been a nice walk actually, quite a nice walk. Uh, there is signs up saying about keep to the bridal path uh, because there's some private land here as well so I'm not sure <laughs> what's been the right spot to be honest but you know the traffic though, that's a shame isn't it, you've got the motorway right next to it but uh, anyway, yeah okay right I'm going to sign off and uh, the next trip should be to actually a campsite so uh, it won't be a uh, lot we've had so far but um it's, i think it's quite a nice one well that's if we can get in <laughs> if we can't get in it's another brit stop so i've got a few backups planned so uh but jan's should be on the phone now back at the van uh ringing him up and find out if we can get in on this uh, particular campsite uh, I'll, tell, I'll give you more details about it on the next video it ain't just a really expensive campsite or anything it's about eight pound odd a night really good value so uh, hopefully we can get on there if we can't we've got other backups planned uh, we're going to them anyway but uh, but yeah okay so thanks for being with us again uh, if you like what you've seen give us a thumbs up if not thumbs down the usual stuff subscribe and uh, we'll see you again next week so from me and Charlie who's playing with sticks <laughs> he loves sticks We'll see you again next week. Ta-da. Mm -hmm.